Hey everybody, Marcin here. Welcome to my very first tutorial on YouTube. I want to give you a quick advice how to shoot a drone hyperlapse. All you need is a drone, some moving objects like the clouds or some cars, and the software for the post-production. I use After Effects and Final Cut Pro. And the most important is a safety officer. Run. Fuss. Let's talk about the settings. It really depends on the light conditions. In my case, I want to shoot in manual mode, ISO 100 and the shutter speed, let's say 100. Please make sure to shoot in RAW. And let's put it here to 60 to 9, because we want to make a movie from it. Let's go into the waypoint menu, choose waypoints, set my first waypoint. I want to go 200 or 300 meters. Then press again C1, so we set the second and final waypoint. Let's apply this. The second very important step is to set the speed. In my opinion it's around 1 km per hour. Picture time. 50 minutes long. Every second, 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 a picture. Okay, after a safe flight, let's go ahead to the post-production. Let's import a new file. First, we open the folder where we have put together all the images. And we choose just one picture. In options, you have, if you shoot it in RAW, the possibility to choose a camera RAW sequence. That's pretty cool, because we can work just with one picture. You can adjust the picture as you like. Then let's make a new composition. We can go into the composition settings. And I want to have it in 4K. Now it's necessary to stabilize it. I use the automatic ROB stabilizer. So let's apply it. And I want to have at least 80%. This process take a while. But I like it quick and dirty. Perfect. Now let's put it into the render queue. Choose the settings how we want. Best settings sounds cool. Here we go. Sweet, now you can import the rendered file for example in Final Cut Pro and make your movie project come alive. Any questions? Please place it into the comments so I can respond to it. If you like this tutorial, click on my head and subscribe to the channel. Visit also my Facebook page and stay tuned for the next project. Hope to see ya!